been two months since our next guest was here, uh, when <laughs> when the secret house was merely a blueprint in the uh, and the, the idea of an ex housemate returning was just an evil twinkle in somebody's eye. I've got wood, Sarah Kaywood. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Sarah. How are you? Last time you were here, Ashley yeah. and Sam, dear Lord, had just become her housemates. Did you foresee Ashley to be in the final week? Oh no. I thought she was a bit of an airhead, actually. Do you I think thought she'd be... be in and out. Yeah, really? Yeah. How's that? Okay. And also, it's difficult for people that come in later to stay in. Well, she's done really well in that she's regard. Really isn't well. She? Uh, at the time you described the house as the bitchiest you've ever seen, do you mm. think that's changed? Yes, because okay. Grace is no longer in it. Woo wee! Do you think she. Do I lie? Do you think she was the only one that was a bitch in there? No, but I think she was definitely used to get the wooden spoon out, didn't she? But now it's just a bit more. I don't know, it seems that people just want to shout at each other now, as opposed to kind of being behind the well, It's more back. honest, I think. Isn't yeah, it? absolutely. It's and less two-faced. Did you, did you see that when Grace went back in? Did you think it was a bit more bitchy then when she went yeah. back in? Or, they were so different when they, when they went back in, because they were talking about magazine deals. Oh, I stuff. know, I know. It was, it was Actually, I didn't really enjoy it very much. I was like, oh, it's Yeah, it was, it was kind of TV eating itself. Yeah. But at the same time, it was fascinating, but in a purely different way. Absolutely. It was almost a byproduct. They were kind of comparing notes with each other, weren't they? Who's got the best deal? Okay, <laughs> but you're, still, you're still liking the fact that now that people are arguing and so forth. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. I love a bit of confrontation, me. With that in mind, uh, we've picked out your favourite arguments. Let's take a look. I complimented you and said, yes, you are. You wouldn't be horrible to anyone. And you are cooking Liam and Richard a nice meal so she could spend time with Richard. I thought you said to me, oh, that I, I, I did not compliment you. And then you stood Too there hard. and Jane, I went, Jane's giving me the impression that I'm not supportive. You stood there and said that to Sue. Oh, me, 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 oh, me. Oh, shut me. your mouth. No, you shut yours. You're so boring. So and you're so self-centred. Get over yourself. What, like you are? Five minutes ago, Ooh. you didn't want to be around Glyn because Glyn fancied you, and how does that look what? on telly? Now you're all over him. You're so fake. It's a game, mate. Mate? <laughs> Don't no. do that, lad. Don't no. do that. Don't, no. don't, 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 don't raise the cue on your face. Shut up yourself. Don't raise the cue on your face. You're the one that's going on. Mate, you're the one that's going on. Don't raise the cue on your face. You're the one that's going on. I don't want to know. Don't raise the cue on your face again. I haven't. I'm saying to you, don't do it. I'm just saying that. You did. Don't do it again. No, mate. You're the one that's going on. Don't do it again. I'm telling you, Glenn. Yeah, shut up. Love about Glenn's last love. Oh, shut up. So, who's the most argumentative housemate left? Um, I know the Jenny. Well, Jenny's a bit moody, isn't she? Well, is she's, she's, she's a bit of a bulldog chewing a wasp. I you know think. I mean? See, it's interesting bit, because I think she's probably hormonal, maybe. Well, yeah. You know, when our researchers asked you this question, we thought to ourselves, well, yes, because she does like an argument, Jenny. But she's such a pretty, intelligent, smart young girl. But when she argues, watch this, right? Jenny, very beautiful housemate. You can just see it there. There's Jane. She's having an argument with Jane. Suddenly, <laughs> da 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 da. -da. Those hand movements as well. Okay, your, your highlights of this series. Oh, um, highlights. One of them has definitely got me when Pete fell in the pool. It's brilliant. I laughed my socks off. I really just like, Ooh. The great thing about that moment, though, was it was a slapstick moment. And normally slapstick moments, you can see the housemates kind of go, uh-oh, this is going to be on my best bits. Woohoo! <laughs> Whereas Pete, because he was having a, an attack, as it were, he went back and he was mortified. He didn't want to fall in the pool. He was just sort of clawing himself back. Um, lastly, who do you think is going to win? Um, I think he's going to win. I think actually, everyone's saying Pete. I think Glenn's going to give him a run for his money. Think, look at Nikki being evicted. Nobody expected that. Mm. I think there could be an upset. Ashley in second favourite. Yeah. Any okay. About I that? could. Um, it's very rare for girls to win because girls tend not to vote for girls. Which we we're, we're not nice to each other, ladies. <laughs> unfortunately. <laughs> but um, but I'd like to see another girl win because we've only had one. That was Kate Lawler. Last time you were here, mm -hmm. you were a massive Dicky fan. Is that yeah. still the case? I still love Dick. You still love yes. Dicky. Therefore, are you still. <laughs> are you? St it gets worse. Are you still happy, therefore, for your face to be on Dicky's box? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I am. Damn it. The K-Wood's happy, the face is still on the box. Sarah K-Wood, everyone! <laughs> <laughs>